Hi there and welcome to this tutorial on GCSE Biology for the AQA specification focusing on communicable diseases and in particular fungal diseases. I'm Shumana from StudyMind where we help you revise GCSE Biology with our helpful video tutorials tailored to your subject, your specification and to you. If you're new here, make sure you click the subscribe button. Whilst you are watching, please leave any comments below if you're unsure about anything and let us know if it's your first time watching our videos so we can send you our free revision materials. We also have helpful timestamps below for each part of the video to help guide you through the specification. So let's get started. Hello and welcome to tutorial four of nine on fungal diseases. So in previous tutorials we've looked at viral diseases and bacterial diseases, and we're now moving on to the third type of pathogen, fungal diseases. Right, so we're just looking at one type of fungal disease today, so a fairly simple tutorial, and that's going to be rose black spot. So, rose black spot is a fungal disease that attacks the leaves of plants, so commonly roses, as, as um, is obvious from the name but also some other types of plants. And the attacking of the plant by this fungus gives them these black or purple spots and the leaves subsequently turn yellow and fall off. So if leaves are dropping off this plant, there's going to be less surface area for photosynthesis to occur and therefore less net photosynthesis is going to be occurring in the plant. So remember fungal um, pathogens, they tend to spread disease by their spores that they release from chlamydia and there's three methods of spread in the case of rose black spot that can be waterborne transmission, airborne transmission or direct um, leaf to leaf transmission. So for example um, waterborne transmission so it can be spread through water you know rivers lakes but also in, in the rain um, that can wash the spores off and spread it to the next leaf or the next plant and also wind may blow um, the spores towards other plants or other leaves. So how is this treated? Well, it's a fungal disease, so we're gonna be using fungicides to treat rose black spot, or the infected leaves may, may be removed, and this will just reduce transmission. So that's all for today. That was a really short and speedy tutorial, but perhaps what you could do is compare and contrast this to the viral diseases and the bacterial diseases that we've covered and have a look at the differences in transmission and symptoms and treatment. Well done, and I'll see you for the next session. Thanks for watching this free video from StudyMind. If you liked this video, make sure to subscribe to catch our newest videos by clicking below and leave a comment on a topic you'd like a video on. Click here to watch more videos in our series for GCSE Biology, or visit our website, studymind.co.uk, for free past paper compilations by topic and specification.